Is the DV Novices Hurdle next? This is a two mile seven furlong Novices Hurdle, so it's virtually three miles. And at the top, we've got Sonning Eye for Darren Thompson, Atonement Jasper Sutherland, Chand Point Darren Thompson, Hidden Persuader Leon Van Rensburg, October Sunset, Graham Clutterbuck, Arlington Killer Vinny Gerard, Bucephalus Idea, David Robertson, Impressive Spirit Jim Murray, Mangum Doodle Craig Allen, Prophet's Passion David Hooley, Shaloon Adams and Ben Bonici, Ijala Sunlight, Ijala Candlelight in fact, Thomas Rogers, Dawn of Lust, Joshua Sutherland, Discoed Fields for Craig Allen, Pretty Ears, Craig Beckwith, Princess Alex Cherry and Spritzer Catherine, Thomas Rogers, a big field then for this one, and they're already racing and heading towards the first of the flights they've got to negotiate, they're racing through the rain, and it's Pretty Ears who's pulling for its head and its ears in the lead, October Sunset second, and over that one they all go, and all hurdled it nicely, Pretty is clearing from then by about four to October Sunset second, and then Arlington Killer is fourth. Chan Point is after that one. Looking through the fur, it looks like we've got just the one grey in this one, and that's Sonning Eye, the top weight, on the number one horse as they get over the next. And Shaloon Adamson is just a back mark as they come up past the impressive looking stand. And it's Pretty is clear, and now past the older of the stands but it's a clear lead for pretty ears by about six lengths they're still spread quite wide across the track i'm not quite sure what that little section there's all about with a stand that's facing totally the wrong way but anyway <laughs> it's pretty ears in the lead from disco fields in second and then dawn of losses after that one with arlington killer and princess one of these been really wide of a track the joshua sutherland and the Vinnie really Gerard horse is almost running off the track. It's also they're looking for better racing ground or something, but uh, doesn't appear to be doing them any harm at the moment. But Pretty Ears is well clear of Disco Fields is at the centre. Then the two right over on the far side are Dawn of Lost and Arlington Killer. Who's just a little bit detached at the back is Shallow Adamson. So it'll be interesting to see when those two that are running wide do come across. But I'm sure they have to at some point. And Pretty Ears is in the lead by a good six. The Dawn of Lost Wild, who may be showing second. You can see they're running right around the outside of the hurdles so there. Well, a little bit odd, but not a particularly big field either. So I don't quite know what's going on there. But they seem to be coming across now. And Pretty Ears it is who continues to lead from Dawn of Lost, is now on the race course proper in second. Then Princess on the inside is third with Disco Fields. Islands and Killers also back on the track. Then comes October Sunset and Chan Point, an impressive spirit and atonement. With Sonning Eye, they're great. Easy to spot that one, Bucephalus idea towards the back. With Prophet's Passion, just the back marker in shot. And Shaloon Adamson is out of shot at this point as they make their way down towards the next that's flight number six and a bit of a mistake there by mangum doodle i've seen that one shuffle towards the back as well but pretty is he's still six clear of dawn of lust second princess third disco fields is fourth arlington killer on the outside he's fifth just being pushed along there was october sunset as they got over that one and they're coming up past the stand again that'll be the final flight next time round and they've still got a mile and a quarter to go and pretty ears is clear by five lengths to dawn of lost in second then past the winning post then another circuit to go please pretty ears in front dawn of lost second hidden persuader gets the first mention in third then arlington killer and chan point and princess and disco fields sonning iron atonement are in that pack as well looking towards the back shallow and adamson has just gone past profits passion as they took fight number nine and pretty ears is in the lead by a good three lengths to in second place, Dawn of Lost, Chan Point is third, Britain Persuader is four, Princess five, Sonning Eye going well in six, then Disco Field and Atonement, and Arlington Killer, an impressive spirit, and Arjuna Candlelight, and Mangum Doodles after that one, and Spritzer Catherine, and the back two, Prophets Passion and Shaloon Adamson, racing down towards the next then, Pretty Ears is two lengths clear now, of Dawn of Lost in second, Chan Point going well in third, then Disco Fields and Sonning Eye, Hidden Persuader, they're all bunched up behind these leaders, you wouldn't rule pretty much anything out yet maybe Shallow Adamson's got work to do but it's in the lead still pretty is pretty is by two 
to Chan Point, who's now just second ahead of Dawn of Lost in third. Then Disco Fields on the outside. Over the tenth they go. Just three more to take now. And Princess is being driven along. Sonning Eye is going to try and get up the inside. But it's Pretty Ears who's still in front, being challenged now by Chan Point and Disco Fields. Dawn of Lost is next. Sonning Eye starting to get going. Also, Princess hidden persuade right around the outside. Mangum Doodle is now really coming into it as well. And also, Prophet's Passion is trying to run on from the back as they come down now towards the final two flights. It's Sonning Eye that's hit the front. Sonning Eye's gone on then, but Mangum Doodle immediately comes through to challenge in Disco Field and Chan Point. Over on the far side, Mangum Doodle is just the leader. It's Mangum Doodle then. Coming down there towards the third last. Gets over it in the lead. He's on the outside of the track. It's Mangum Doodle in the lead. Sonning Eye is second. Disco Fields is third. Then Chan Point. Profit's Passion still running on really well. They've got two to take. And it's Mangum Doodle who's clear. Mangum Doodle, two lengths clear. Over the second last he goes. Sonning Eye's over it in second. Sonning Eye now beginning to eat up the ground. Over the final flight they go. And Sonning Eye's in the front. Chan Point is second. Profit's Passion is running on like a train on the far side. Sonning Eye needs the line. Here comes here comes Chan Point, here comes Prophet's Passion, it's going to be Chan Point just from Prophet's Passion, Sonning Eye after that one, Hidden Persuader finished fast all the way back to Shannon Adamson, and an exciting but messy race as quite a few of them were running off the track at points, it not seem to do them that much harm to be honest, but it doesn't look good, Chan Point though takes it, and look it was going to be a 1-2, Oh, Darren Thompson for all that. Profit's passion come from the back. Right old, right old run. So Chan Point takes it for Darren Thompson. Profit's passion second for David Hooley. Sonning Eye for Darren Thompson third. Hidden Persuader, Leon Van Rensburg fourth. Arlington Killer for Vinnie Gerald was fifth. And I think maybe the stewards might need to take a look at the Galway track and find out what might have gone wrong there because that wasn't a particularly big field and there was quite a few jumping outside the fences. Well, the flights.